Hello everybody, welcome back to Evolve. It is the turn of our pride and joy as a Goliath main. Uh, we're on Armoury for this one, so we are going to do White Tiger. Because this skin does actually match this map pretty damn nicely. Uh, everything except Rock. It is Markov, Abe, Tech Hank and Lazarus. Um, Glitch reversals as always. So this team has already sacrificed a lot of fucking defensive power. In fact, this is the worst combination in the game, I think. Uh, Lazarus and Tech Hank, so... I hate to say it, but this is probably going to be a stomp. So, <laughs> um, provided I don't forget that Laz is in the game once we get into the actual first engage, like I always do. But this is a very, very weak team. Um, Markov is not the strongest assault. Abe is, Abe's up there in terms of trappers. Uh, Tech Hank is the weakest support in the game, and Laz is more or less the weakest medic in the game. <laughs> so. It's a Sunday gaming session, <laughs> this one. <laughs> so if I lose to this shit, I will stop making Evolve videos. So if it is your first Evolve video anyway, um, welcome. This is basically Boss Fight Simulator, as I keep calling it. Um, this game does not shy away from putting the character that usually is being played by the AI into the player's hands, as you'll see by all the wonderful animations and how the actual game itself plays out as well. Because there are a lot of abilities and a lot of nuances to this game that I think a lot of other games are actually scared to do. Um, but you'll, you'll sort of see what I'm saying as we go through it. We do grab ourselves stage 2 very quickly here. We're just going to go straight for it because I think we should have enough distance. So at stage 2, uh, we are in a 50-50 playing field now. This is where you... Well, this is where the majority of the game probably happens. Especially back in the day of actual live multiplayer. Uh, stage 2 monsters are uh, fight ready. So they can afford to engage. So we'll just fill our armor bar up here and then we'll get into our first engage. It's been quite a fast... Uh, they're over there, that's where them striders are running from. So we'll wait here. That's Markov at the front, I can tell by his silhouette. He's got his little backpack on. Oh shit, they've just got move speed. Okay, that's what that little symbol is. This is a bot obviously, so they're going to see that straight away. <laughs> So we'll go for Abe, because Abe is the trapper, hence why I am trapped currently in this big blue dome. We need to get out of that. That's unfortunate, the, uh, the rock hit the dome instead of travelling. There it is. Slam him on that little rock. I didn't have a look at where Laz was. Yeah, I had a, he had a feeling. There he is. I just jumped back to A because I had a feeling he was going to be running in for it. So we, there we go. We'll do that because I can get at least a strike on Laz then. So, contrary to what I actually said at the beginning of this, because I always do this shit in this game, um, we actually lost nearly half of our health there. Uh, and this isn't exactly the strongest of teams. <laughs> so, that's probably been played in. Well, I wouldn't say it was played in a bad way, because we did uh, get two pretty fast downs. It was just a lot of damage off the bat. But yeah, you never know how things are going to go, so... We will push ourselves up to uh, stage 3 here. Let's get ourselves up here, and we'll go for a cliff dive here when, once they come into range. We'll, do, we'll use a leap smash to engage. Look how fucking detailed these characters are, these monsters. Look at this cutie. My son. <laughs> Shit, they might be here actually. There they are. Who's that? Legit leaning into my screen. That's Tech Hank. We can go for that. There we go. I had to see what the uh, the silhouette was. I didn't want to do that into Markov. Is this a god dome? 
He's going through there. I can see his footsteps. He can revive through flames. It doesn't uh, disrupt. It's the wrong ability to use there, but that's fine. We get two strikes on the Laz. Give him a little spin. Show him to the world. So that's what Laz does, by the way. You'll notice he hasn't got a strike now. Because uh, Laz can revive without giving Hunter strikes. Okay, we get splash damage. We'll confirm the death on the Laz here, actually. Because then they'll have to revive Hank. She dodged that. There we go. Now we'll get Abe down because we need to get out of this dome. I'm losing health. Let's judge that. She <laughs> crabbed by that. That's unfortunate. Shit. Oh, that's the uh, animations having a bit of a tizzy. Uh, we will go to stage three actually in this instance. Um, yeah, we'll just go for it. They'll be reviving at the moment, so. Feels like it's been a bit of a fast one, this one. Very fast paced. We're now stage 3, so we are now definitively the power roll. If you've played DBD, this will be a breath of fresh air if you play killer in that game and often feel like you're not the power roll. Welcome to Evolve. Um, you'll see uh, actual power roll here. So we'll grab all this. Let's get some more first. I was going to say, I didn't think to uh, pick up the move speed buff that they killed, but I wouldn't have been able to get it anyway, actually, thinking about it, because they were all there. There we go. Now fully armoured, we are now ready to go in. As a literal triple A endgame boss. Fucking hell. Might have hit that, actually, if it was... Uh, didn't hit that thing. There we go. We'll go for Abia, just so we, can, we don't get domed. I don't know where Laz is though, which is a bit of a, a worry. There we go. There he is. It's cloaked. Using the rock to evade me, uh, flame breath. Was that him? Yeah, it was. The thing with the Laz bot is it is very predictable because as soon as you down somebody, it will just like beeline for him. <laughs> So, obviously back in the day of uh, live, it was a bit harder to see where Laz was. Because it was a, a person that was actually fucking hiding from you. Not just, shit, I didn't mean to disrupt that actually. I was just explaining the differences between an AI Laz and a human Laz. Shit. I was expecting him to slide back a little bit more. That's going to be Jeej, I think. Yeah. Stage 3 Goliath, boys. Not to be messed with. 727, that was quite a very quick one, actually. As I say, I mean, we lost half the he uh, half our elf uh, in the first engage, but at the same time, like I said at the beginning, it was a team that didn't really have much sustain. Um, Tekank is just very weak. Uh, and Lazarus can only really... He's only got his healing burst to actually heal people. So he's kind of a medic that relies on his team dying and the monster not paying attention to it. Um, but yeah, there it is. It do be like that sometimes. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed, and I will hopefully see you on future videos. Bye.